मंथला मिस करतो आहे तू पण मग अशी म्हटलंस तसं जेव्हा पहिली फिल्म लिहिली गेली तेव्हा फॅमिली मराठी करावी हे निशिकांचा विचार होता काय नेमकं त्याच्या डोक्यात होतं आणि आज जर निशिकांत आपल्या आजूबाजूला आहे तर तू काय त्याला मेसेज देशील आय थिंक निशी के बारे में जो बोलना था हमने बोल दिया जितना बात करो उतना कम है लेकिन ये अब मौका उनके बारे में बात करने का नहीं नहीं है इसलिए वी ऑल मिस हिम जैसे कि मैंने कहा अगर आज वो यहाँ होता तो वी वुड हैव बिन वेरी वेरी हैप्पी बट द शो मस्ट गो ऑन थैंक यू अजय सर ओवर यर टू वर्ड्स योर राइट ओवर यर Firstly, congratulations to the team for the excellent trailer. Ajay sir, my question to you is: In early 2000s, you did a film called Diwangi, wherein Akshay Khanna was a criminal lawyer trying to frame you in the case. And now you are doing Drishyam again. He is a cop and trying to frame you. How is it to reunite with him in a similar space? And how did this casting happen? Uh, casting, I think uh, Abhishek decided. But uh, it's always fun, and it's uh, we share a great rapport also, uh, Akshay and me. and uh, and it's always great to work with a good actor and uh, because good actors bring out the best in you also and uh, we needed somebody like him so it's always it's it's great it's really great thank you hi this is vibha here 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 yeah. this side uh fabulous we had a wonderful time yesterday watching the film again uh I shared this with Abhishek yesterday that uh, when Tabu turns around and looks at uh, Ajay and says ki she doesn't say anything but unki aankhon ne bata diya hamare ko it leads to the drishyam to so mera sawal ye hai ki ek maa ka pyar माँ का जो स्टैंड है और एक फैमिली का स्टैंड तो अब ये जो एक लेवल पे है इसको जस्टिफाई करना मतलब एक बहुत बड़ा टास्क है ये मतलब क्योंकि दोनों ही अपनी लेवल पे सही है और कहीं मतलब एक गलत भी है सो so, आप दोनों इसको किस तरह से एज एक्टर्स देखते हैं और इस इन कैरेक्टर्स को किस तरह से देखते हैं both of you you were fantastic fantastic all of you thank you mai jaisa ki aapne kaha ki dono characters apni apni jagah sahi hai uh ek maa jiska beta jawani mein you know is killed uh, she is not ready to accept ke kya hua tha kyun hua tha ya uska beta galat hai ye i think uh, most of the mothers are like this and will be like this always तो हर कैरेक्टर इज राइट मेरा कैरेक्टर सही है क्योंकि आदमी कुछ भी करेगा अपनी फैमिली को प्रोटेक्ट करने के लिए तो ये जो क्लैश है ये बहुत ज्यादा इंटरेस्टिंग हो जाता है वरना क्या एक नेगेटिव कैरेक्टर होता है एक पॉजिटिव कैरेक्टर होता है तो आपको पता है कि कौन जीतने वाला है बट इसमें जो क्लैश है दैट्स एन इमोशनल क्लैश सो इट्स वेरी वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग सो इट वॉज वेरी डिफिकल्ट फॉर मी मेरे लिए बहुत ही मतलब मुश्किल था बिकॉज ये कॉम्प्लिकेटेड इमोशंस हैं बहुत सारी मतलब इश्यूज़ हैं इसके अंदर उसको सही भी रहना है शी हैज़ टू बी ट्रू टू हर प्रोफेशन आल्सो बट वो जो वो जो महसूस कर रही है वो तो महसूस कर रही है एंड एवरीथिंग दैट आर कैरेक्टर्स रजत कैरेक्टर्स फीलिंग माय कैरेक्टर्स फीलिंग अजय कैरेक्टर्स फीलिंग द फैमिलीज कैरेक्टर्स द फैमिलीज फीलिंग इज लाइक पार्ट ऑफ बींग ह्यूमन तो आप कई बार आपको मालूम होता है कि सही क्या है गलत क्या है लेकिन आप अपने जज्बात और अपनी फीलिंग्स से परे नहीं जा सकते हो नहीं जा पाते हो सो आई थिंक दैट वाज़ द स्ट्रगल ऑफ बीइंग मीरा देशमुख ऑन स्क्रीन इट्स वन ऑफ माय मोस्ट डिफिकल्ट रोल्स मोस्ट डिफिकल्ट कैरेक्टर्स दैट आई हैव प्लेड एंड आई मस्ट मस्ट गिव क्रेडिट एंड थैंक्स टू जीतू जोजेफ मोहनलाल सर राशि शरद मैम एंड फॉर राइटिंग दिस कैरेक्टर because it's very unusual uh, of for writers to write these kind of roles and characters where you cannot you cannot say she's good she's bad she comes with an entire package of being right wrong good bad but finally you know that she's a mother who's just 
it's beyond her to be okay with losing her son. Thank you. Namaskar, my name is Pankaj. Here, here. और मेरा सवाल हालांकि चूंकि पूरी टीम रिपीट हो रही है दृश्यम टू में अभिषेक अमिताभ और डीएसपी तीन नए लोग हैं इसमें तो इन तीनों लोगों से मेरा सवाल है एक तो डीएसपी से सवाल है काफी बातें होती रही हमारी किसी फिल्म का बैकग्राउंड म्यूजिक बनाना गाने तो आप अच्छे बनाते हैं मेलोडी भी अच्छी बना रहे हैं बैकग्राउंड म्यूजिक बनाना गोवा में सेट एक स्टोरी है जो आपके हैबिटेट से बिल्कुल दूर है उस कहानी का मर्म समझना उसकी आत्मा समझना उसके हिसाब से बैकग्राउंड म्यूजिक तैयार करना कितना मुश्किल रहा और अमिताभ से सवाल यह है कि आपको एक फिल्म जो सुपरहिट फिल्म है दृश्यम उसके सीक्वल के लिए गाने लिखना कितना चुनौतीपूर्ण रहा और पहली बार आप लोग एक साथ काम कर रहे हैं आप प्रोड्यूस भी लवली क्वेश्चन सर मुझे तो समझ गया आपका क्वेश्चन लेकिन इतने आंसर में हिंदी में नहीं दे सकता हूँ इसलिए मैं इंग्लिश में हिंदी में आंसर स्ट्रेट में भी टॉप लग गया यस सर एंड थैंक यू सर फॉर ऑल द सपोर्ट ही हैज ऑलवेज बीन सपोर्टिंग ऑफ मी फॉर वेरी लॉन्ग टाइम थैंक यू सर व्हेन मीडिया सपोर्ट्स एन आर्टिस्ट सो मच आई थिंक दैट्स एन now so yeah um first of all on this occasion i would also love to extend another thanks uh, to all of you for loving my uh, songs and also the background score of pushpa so so what happens is down south i'm already used to you know working on all the songs and the background score as well when we listen to a subject it becomes possible for a music composer to you know connect each and every song and then take the song to be a part of the scene and lot of uh, while i'm listening to the narration itself uh, it it makes it possible for me to think of which song could be the background score of this uh, particular scene or this background score could become a part of a song which comes in the climax of the movie you know things like that so like though the movie is set in goa so how i do the background score is so the background score is always set to the mood of the Uh, subject written by the director whether it happens in goa or mexico or vegas wherever it happens there is a uh, there is a certain uh, mood and certain uh, emotion to every subject right so i follow that uh, uh, mood and the um, intensity of the subject and drishyam 2 has been a um, uh, very very intense subject and 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 it really inspired me to you know score music for each and every scene and uh, we also came out with some catchy songs which first we thought how will drishyam to have some catchy songs but then i always believe in the fact that the same song can be you know expressed in a hundred different ways you know you got to choose without losing the essence and the flavor of the original story we can still make a song that will be catchy and that's what we tried to do and abhishek parak sir also like he was very excited with the songs and uh, our amitabh sir made it even more exciting with his lyrics sir amitabh se jawab sunne se pehle aapne jo baat kahi ki gaane ka background music kaise kisi gaane mein tabdeel ho sakta hai ye agar raj kapoor ki filme hum dekhte hain jab ek film ka background music agli film mein wo gaana ban jata hai exactly sir see it happened in a couple of my films also sir in when i scored in telugu and tamil so one background score particularly when it becomes a hit we made even uh, actually ida raja sir was one of those stalwarts who did that and made us used to that also sir so yes sir uh, ji aapka sawal jahan tak yaad hai mujhe to फिल्म जैसे कि मैंने पहले भी कहा दृश्यम वन का फैन हूँ मैं मतलब पहले भी देखी थी कल थिएटर में आप सबके साथ ही देखी बहुत मज़ा आया और जब कोई एक चीज़ ऑलरेडी पॉपुलर होती है एक्सेप्टेड होती है हिट होती है तो उसके साथ जुड़ना जिम्मेदारी का काम तो होता ही है दृश्यम वन में विशाल भारद्वाज साहब और गुलजार साहब के गाने थे जो मैं उनका बहुत बड़ा भक्त हूँ बहुत बड़ा फ़ैन हूँ तो दम घुटता है और मेरी कार्बन कॉपी है तो ये बहुत फेवरेट गाने हैं मेरे लेकिन ये सोचने लगी है तो लिखना मुश्किल हो जाता है सो so, लिखते वक्त यही कोशिश करता हूँ कि बस मोमेंट में रहूँ और एक कमाल की कहानी है और कमाल का कंपोजर है हमारे साथ तो उनके साथ चेन्नई में मैं अभिषेक कुमार जी डीएसपी के साथ मिले बैठे और बस देखते देखते हंसी खेल में गाने बन गए तो आई होप आप लोग को पसंद आए जब आप सुने दैट्स ऑल no so i what am i what am i kya
So I have seen him since I like I think first film itself. For me, I was I don't I remember him calling Bhaiya even now till now I call him that. Uh, it was obviously very uh, a nervous moment for me when I went on my first shoot day. Okay, I don't know how will I even you know tell him to do this because he's been such a senior and actor since so many years and me just doing my uh, second film and it's gonna be a little uh, kind of that kind of moment for me. But I think he made it so comfortable even throughout the shoot. I never saw him coming across the table of the monitor. We're standing there, just uh, uh, following what I'm telling. Uh, he exactly knew what exactly script required, so I don't think it's very easy working with him. Tabu Mam is a fab actor. We have all known her. Dekha inka kam to. I mean, I have such beautiful actor who are like this cake walk for them. Technically, it's not easy. Tell me. Such a good actor. Such a good actor. Such a good actor. Such a good actor. I never said that. <laughs> no, I think all my actors, uh, everyone is standing here, and Akshay sir is not here right now. Uh, it's been fabulous working with them, all of them. Uh, it, they read the script so well, they understood the character so well, and I think it was very uh, beautiful right on the set when we started working. It was a lot of fun, and it was intimidating. It was a lot of fun. Ajay sir, towards center. This side. Uh, first of all, congratulations to the entire team. What a spectacular trailer it was. Uh, one thing that I observed from part one and now the Drishim two that it's see, there's a scene where Kamlesh Sawant actually you know he thrashes the ladies. There's a scene which is being depicted and in the real life it's something which is unconstitutional and illegal. And such a scene is being portrayed in the film. How do you see this and what do you have to say about it? But that's what the film is all about. That they are pushing the bar a little to get whatever they want. Uh, they are not going about it in a very legal manner. And uh, if they were going about it in a legal manner, then there was no threat in the film. So uh, they are characters uh, who want vengeance, and uh, they would they would go to any extent to do whatever they want to do. So that's where the whole fear lies with the family. And also, uh, the character Guy Tonde in part one he was suspended for this kind of act. So again, that is just personality. It's all personal for every character there, yes. not not just for Tabu, but for him also. Yeah, it's it's character in part one. It's continuing. He's like all revengeful. He's now back again, and he will push all the limit to just get what he wants to. Yeah. Uh, uh, hi, this is Suhail here from Ancient Bollywood Center. Me, sir, here. Ajay ji, you are. Uh, just you are, uh, just you are, just you are, you are very lucky with sequels. Actually, you know, I mean, you have made a lot of films, and then later you have made sequels. Drishyam ke jo pehla part tha, was it decided right from the beginning, like you know, ke wo jo last wala scene tha, ke hum, and were you so all confident about it, like you know, ke hum iska ek second sequel bhi banaye ge? Aap jo koi film banate hai, uska ye nahi sochte ke iska sequel banega, film jab chalti hai, hit ho jati hai, logon ko bhoat zyada pasand aati hai, aur phir jab log OTT पे और सैटेलाइट पे बार-बार फिल्म को देख के फ्रेश रखते हैं। That is the time you decide कि you can make a sequel out of this। तो कभी भी कोई भी फिल्म जब आप बना रहे हो ये नहीं सोचते कि इसका सीक्वल भी बनाएंगे। उसके लिए पहले ऑडियंस को पिक्चर पसंद आनी चाहिए। सर आपने जैसे कहा था कि अभिषेक को कि वैन पढ़ाई के लिए कि ultimately you have to come to बोला था पढ़ाई कर उसके बाद फिर जो करना है correct तो how do you find him now like he directed you in fact like you know अभी कितना number दोगे आप इस तरह fabulous job he has done actually a fabulous job shooting पे भी I could realize that and after I saw portions of the film also he has done a fabulous job अब trailer से आपको नजर ही आ रहा है तो I am very very proud of it I am very happy Hi, Arun from NDTV. Hi, Arun from NDTV here. My question is for Abhishek. Uh, since this is a sequel and the first one was a great hit and there's always a pressure on the sequel, have you give it, given it some edge or you've intacted the essence to deal with that pressure? Uh, I don't think that there was any need to change any essence or soul of the film. That's the more uh, paramount of the film, I think. We cannot touch that. But there is a treatment, there is a mood which I have given to the film, the vision which we attach to the film. I think that's a USP which we will, when you watch the film, you will come to know. Even if you see the trailer, the specific tone, treatment, the performance you will see, it's a little bit in our mind. But uh, yeah, soul uh, is something which we want to retain and which we have, I think, uh, stuck to. That's, I think, uh, which when you watch the film, you will enjoy with the, with the treatment and the kind of thriller genre. I mean, pushed to another level in this film. Yeah. 
Sure. Thanks. Chalo, book nahi lagi aap logon ko. Hello. Chale. Hi, Ajay sir. Amit Bhatia from ABP News. Sir, as we have seen in the video, have you ever used the filming situation in real life? Or vice versa? I have to think about it. Maybe what is it? Why will you tell us? Yes, what is it, but I don't remember now. Hi, uh, Abhimanyu, this side from Hindustan Times, this side behind. Tabu ma'am, this is for you. Um, when the first Trishim came out, of course it was a, a remake, but at that time, the consumption of South films was not as much as it is today due to ODT and everything. So this still, this film was still new to the audiences. Now, with the remakes having been watched on OTT, uh, with the sequels rather, the Malayalam and Telugu films, how confident are you about the freshness of, of this film for the audiences since two films have already come with a similar same plot on in different languages? Yeah, but like uh, Vishak said that the film has been treated in a very different manner. And uh, there are a lot of characters added. So there are a lot of, lot of changes. I mean, uh, you wouldn't see uh, Akshay's character in the film and uh, Gai, Gai Tonde in the film. So a lot of changes have been made. Like he said, also keeping the soul of the film intact. So I think when you see the film, it's, it's going to be very fresh for you. So you know, when we started writing the film, it's not that we just went and started shooting. We took at least seven months to write the film. So there are a lot of changes which we try to do, which actually makes it very different than uh, the Malayalam and the other versions completely. Thank you. We'll take one last question, right? There is none. Shall I push you? Yeah. Abhishek, sir, for you, you know, Zada direct karne me Zada maza kise aya? Ye pushtaun si de. Was it Ajay sir? Nah, 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 sir. Wo, wo, abhi wo unane thoda sa, mein push raho. Ajay sir ya Tabu ma'am? Dono me se. If you had to choose, sir, director's actor, sir. Aisa look de rahe, sir, mereko abhi mein to bhasmo jata ya. Ji. Director's actor, sir. Tera sabal bhoat. I swear. Mein unha time ke liye dheen. Mein to mo bandra ko question. Wohi, wohi. Yer question hi nahi koi yaar. इतना मजा है सबको ट्रैक कर रहे हैं दोनों के साथ क्यों नहीं आ सकता मतलब क्यों नहीं आ सकता ओके दैट्स ऑल वी हैव फॉर यू लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन यू गाइस वर ऑसम एंड गिव इट अप फॉर द्रिश्यम टू जोरदार तालियां हो जाए the amazing, amazing team, and of course, uh, would like to invite on stage the co-producers, Mr. Sanjeev Joshi and Mr. Aditya Choksi, जिनके बिना ये complete नहीं होता. Also, would like to invite on stage Mr. Nishan Pitti from Is My Trip. And I knock say Mr. Puneet Gupta, of course, Big Picks, the largest screen in Goa. Of course, we saw this thing here. And Mr. Suraj Mishra, ladies and gentlemen, a very special thanks to him. Suraj, sir, kindly, uh, you know, grace the stage. Shalu Mishra ji is here. Would like to invite uh, the person on stage. Also, Ravi Kesar ji, unko bhi bulana chahenge. And that's not all. Team ki uh, baat kar rahe hai. Toh pe team mein se Sandeep Francis Saab, uh, the editor of the movie, ladies and gentlemen. Mr. Sudhir Chaudhary, the DOP. Navinder Pal Singh ji. Tony Saab, bole to creative director. And Raj Nandini Rati ji, who's the uh, DA, director's assistant. Give it up for the entire team, ladies and gentlemen. Ek baar zordar taliyan.